Before you have any attempt to make a purchase, your card's already wiped out. 70-year-old John Leonardo of East Boston is among the thousands of SNAP food assistance recipients whose benefits were stolen by scammers using card skimmers. They took $297. That was on March 4th. John says he went to the Department of Transitional Assistance office in Chelsea to report the theft and try to get his benefits restored. Whether well, they get the FBI involved or somebody, somebody got to track these, these clowns down. I mean, and that's all I can say is they really are clowns. To take away from people that are less fortunate than themselves, shame on them. Congress passed legislation last year restoring funding nationwide for two months of benefits for theft victims. But some recipients have been without their benefits for far longer. Governor Maura Healey has included $2 million for SNAP benefit replacement in her supplemental budget to compensate for the shortfall not covered by limited federal funding. We've heard from the state agency last fall that about $1.6 million was stolen. The Massachusetts Law Reform Institute says part of the reason this scam is so widespread is that EBT cards are more vulnerable because they do not have more secure chip card technology. We are strongly advocating with our state agency and with the federal government to move quickly and with urgency to implement stronger and improved and modern technology to protect low-income consumers and, frankly, taxpayer dollars. John now has a new EBT card, and he is optimistic that he will receive his benefit for April. But as for the March money, that might ultimately depend on what happens in Washington and with lawmakers here on Beacon Hill. Reporting live at the Statehouse, Todd Keskiewicz, WCVB News Center 5.